stream is live. Okay. Hello, everyone, and welcome to uh, Smash Orange versus Providence College Week 7. Oh, my God, we're in Week 7 already. ECAC matchup. With me today is uh, Frisco. How are you doing, Frisco? Doing awesome. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. I cannot wait to see our Smash team here taking on PC. Uh, they're one of my biggest fans, uh, if you don't know. Oh. They love me In over what there. Way? I, I don't really know why, but they love me over there. <laughs> well, um, hey, I love you too, so it works out. <laughs> if they love you, then, you know, they're all good in my book. It was like, it, it was back in the spring, we had a Valorant match against them, and they found my YouTube video of me shoutcasting the Valorant match, and they were like, oh my god, someone shoutcasted our Valorant match, and they were like all for it. <laughs> And then, then later, because later on, I had no idea about this, right? And then later on, um, I find I, I was doing a recruitment event, and uh, one of their guys came into the room, like because we all had separate chat rooms, yeah. and he was like, "Oh, hey!" And I was like, "Oh, hey! Did you have a question about our program or whatever?" And he was like, "Oh, no, man! We're from Providence College. We wanted to say that we love you, Coach Teddy. We're all you guys are awesome." Blah blah. <laughs> And I was like, what? Why? And he was like, oh, yeah, you shoutcasted our Valorant match last season. And I was like, oh, cool. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Hey, yeah, they're, they're pretty cool, guys. Oh, I love this soundtrack that's playing right now. Do you know what this song is? I actually cannot hear it through the... Oh, uh, that's right. I'm not streaming the audio. Yeah. What's... How, how does the melody go? Hit me with that melody, Denny. It's from Fire Emblem. It's oh, from, is it? It's from Ike's Fire Emblem, yeah. Oh, uh, I never played that. It's a great game if you like strategy games. I do, once in a while. Uh, it's something I, I'll have to give it a try. I actually really liked the, um, I played the one with Lin in it. Yes, uh, that was the, uh, seven. I, yeah, I, I liked that one. So I'll probably give the other ones a try eventually. But I see uh, that- Honestly, uh, better. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Uh, in my opinion, yeah. The later ones are better. Most of the time, was... that's not really true. Most of the time, you uh, the sequels are not. The sequels are not as good sometimes, but in this uh, case, I think that's definitely true. We should get to the to match here because we're already <laughs> yes. two stocks in. We're just <laughs> I... shooting the shit over here as Proto is uh, facing off against the Incineroar from PC uh, James. I'm not sure if they're all playing from one Switch or not. See that Proto has brought out the Kirby, which I'm not yeah, terribly been, familiar with this Kirby. He's been feeling the Kirby lately. He likes it. He likes his, his little down airs into into down smashes. Ah, uh, okay. Then that'll be perfect for him. He likes being small. Oh, Chromo is some Lord 420. Thank you for the follow. Big I saw a clip. Lands pretty even now. I saw a clip today of Kirby low profiling Ganon's up smash, but it's the back <laughs> <What>? hit. <laughs> yeah, it's the back hit. So the back hit of Ganon's up smash, I guess technically doesn't hit the floor. So he can if he, if Kirby's oh, crouching, funny. he low profile he oh, low profiles it. It's so nuts. Yeah, he's so tiny. Yeah, little boy. One thirty-seven though. Yeah, Incineroar we're looking out mighty to toasty. A one stock lead now. And he lands that sweet spot. With nice twenty-two percent. Nice Gotta keep air. careful. Be edge Very guarding nice. opportunity here for Frodo. Almost had it. Makes it back, but the up smash catches him on the platform, and we're dead even again. Well timed, well timed. I could have sworn he was going to go right for the down smash right after. <laughs> the, the tried and true incinero. Yep. Combo there from James. Ooh, forward air going to land as well. Ooh, nice, nice awareness going low. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. <laughs> He's like... Oh, and oh, yep. there's a sweet spot. That's gonna yeah. do it. Yeah, he sends him, sends him left, and that's Hundo gonna do percent. it. PC with a one sock lead to open up game one with the Incineroar. I'm getting the sense that they want to go fast here, so uh, should be heading straight to uh, EB next. They're gonna keep the same stage. I'm just gonna make sure uh, EB knows. Okay. Hey, Eevee, uh, good GG Proto, by the way. Eevee, it is small battlefield for the stage. We're just I gonna... can't hear you very well, Coach. Oh, sorry. I was just saying it's small there battlefield. We We're just going to do small battlefield oh. for all the games. Okay. Um, I'll 
Sorry, I, it was on Callus. Oh, no problem. I was just sorting out my Pokemon cards because the calendar's calling me down. Okay, no problem. Um, Don't forget to let him SD twice, and good luck. Oh, yay. Got one stock. He got two stocks. Right, but I mean, like, I have one stock to take. Oh, yes, can, can, yes. Can we do four seven eights? Oh, sure. Thank you. We kind right. of stopped doing that. Yeah, sorry about that. Should definitely do that. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. Who wants to lead? I will one second. Okay. Alright. We're breathing in mm -hmm. for two, three, four, and hold for two, three, four, five, six, seven, and out. For two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Again, breathing in for two, three, four, and hold for two, three, four, five, six, seven, and out for two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Last one, breathe in for two, three, four, and hold for two, three, four, five, six, seven, and out for two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight. Thank you. All right, you ready? No, but I'll <laughs> give it my best shot. That's all we could ask. Just give it your best shot. Um, my friend Chris is out there on the stream somewhere, so oh, nice. shout out. <laughs> shout out. Um, yeah, just I make sure it's on small battlefield and not like the yeah. Omega or battlefield form. Oh, um... <laughs> Let me actually double check that because sometimes the way my brain works is questionable. Like, the f like, okay, no, not the way. Just like, how? Like, so is it battlefield or normal? Uh, small battlefield. Yeah, but small battlefield, like the normal. Yep, version just or normal battlefield? small battlefield. You okay. Got it. Okay, with the two platforms, not the three. Yes. Got it. Yes. That's that's what I was trying to figure out. <laughs> no problem. All right. Good luck. <sighs> Thank you. All right, I'm back. Welcome back. We we were doing some breathing. That was the delay. <laughs> uh, hey, but it's yes. very important to get breathing in. If you're not breathing, the right headspace. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. We actually have a specific breathing technique. We do. We breathe in for four seconds, then we hold for seven, and we breathe out for eight. Breathe out for how long? Eight seconds. Uh, and then you do that three times in a row. It's nice having rhythms like that. Scientifically it's actually proven to reduce your blood pressure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he just walked over and jumped on him. But yeah, oh, we should be ready to go oh, here. Stream to me, stream me. Oh, my bad. I'm no, you're streaming. fine. Streaming. No. That's so annoying. Yes. So, uh, Evie just needs to take the one stock here from James's Incineroar. Ooh, the roll. Now, this is going to be one of those matchups where um, Inkling's movement is very. You know, versatile in this matchup, considering Cinderor is, is kind of slow. Um, Inkling can kind of outspace Incineroar quite a bit with back airs. Back air, landed back airs being a very strong move uh, against like slower characters and characters that only have disjoints, kind of like Incineroar. Um, but at the same time, Incineroar can delete stocks. Like, oh, I think he's dead. Oh, yep. The SD, he went way yeah. off stage for that one. That's and the thing. Paid the price, and we're all evened up six stocks apiece now as Eevee takes the game. With a character like Incineroar, you can't commit so hard, you know? Stuff like that what happens all the yeah. time. <laughs> yeah. BRB. One second. Oh GG, my God. well played, Eevee. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> I jumped on his head. <laughs> That was really funny. <laughs> yeah, that one. <laughs> I wasn't sure if the match was starting yet or not. You were just like, yeah. hey, what's up? Boop, you're a yeah. Goomba now. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know. Like, because he was just standing there, so I was like, eh, you there? Boop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, boop. <laughs> he was like, oh. <laughs> like, the boop woke him up. He well, you're like, oh. still in Eevee, and it's three to three stocks here, so good awesome. luck. <clears throat> okay, thank you. Alright, we're back. 
Six stocks to six stocks in game one. This sim is going to be a Ness player. Yes. PC. And uh, they are, in fact, all playing from one Switch. So this is a PC fire! Even, <laughs> even, though, even though it is a different... Um, it's just the same name, James, but it is a uh, different player. You know, they're all James in my heart, you know. <laughs> James getting off right to now. a great start here. I'm just going to call them all James. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to call him Jimmy, just for, just, you know, so we, co so we cover our bases, just in case. Oh, true, true. <laughs> but, uh, right now, uh, you know, James is, uh, Evie's got 74% on her. Um, James is doing a quite a bit good job, kind of, you know, keeping the pressure on with a lot of these psychic moves, mm -hmm. you know. Oh, nice F smash though from Eevee. Oh, wow, she gave... almost got caught by that uh, gay flash. Oh that was, my that god. That was so close. Back air lands though at Eevee. Uh... Oh no, Faust fell a little too fast there. An SD. 3 to 2 right now. She's got to be careful with those splat bombs, I think, against Ness, actually, because I. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe he can absorb those. Uh, I am actually not familiar enough with the matchup to know. I, I have a feeling they don't because I feel like it's a it's like more of a physical of projectile. Oh, a little too low, unfortunate. Mm -hmm. I don't. But uh, to be honest, I have to test that. I was uh, I oh, for a second. I was like, just I don't do think it, James. Ness wants to test it. Here. <laughs> <laughs> it's like he's just avoiding them. Pretty so much. Maybe maybe he can't. I would think he maybe he can absorb the ink, but I don't know. Like the actual Nick Neutral B. Mm, yeah. Yeah. I would think so, maybe. I don't know. A lot of aerials coming in right now. James taking his time oh, with his PK that, fire. Uh, F smash off. Oh. I like Evie's uh, idea. What she's doing is trying to. Wow, that was a great recovery, actually. She yeah, went as it was... low as she possibly could. Yeah, that was actually though. really nice. But I like what she's doing, trying to protect her recovery with the uh, splat bombs. Yes. But uh, just throwing them the wrong way. <laughs> oh, out of ink. Yeah, completely out of ink now. Needs to try to find very, some space. Very good job waiting at ledge. Avoiding the PK flash. Yeah. Nice back air. With the, oh, I thought that was going to be a really good follow-up. <laughs> back air. Still needs to fill mess. that ink. Nice landing. Can't find any space to do it, though. This nest player is... Oh, or he could have killed her with a back throw there, I think. The awareness just wasn't quite there. Oh, up throw! Almost. <laughs> she was going for it. She had the right Closer. idea. Wow, oh, 175 not quality, quite doing it. quality stock. Uh, oh. trips right into the PK flash. And that's going to do it for that game. All those PK flashes missed, except for the very last one. The one that was absolutely uh, yes. So it's going to be up to Eastlug now to take six stocks from Providence College here in game one. Leaving Eastlug next in the lineup. Do you think East Slug's bringing out anybody special tonight, just like with Proto, or is he going to bring out the Trident Drew Zelda? No, I, t I told him to bring out the Zelda. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. You wanted to, but I was like, no. No, <laughs> no, no secret surprise. No, right. no. GG, well played, Eevee. Um, Eastlug, you are up. Hmm? Yep. East, Eastlug, you read? Okay. Yep, no, it's, I'm here. I'm here. My bad. I had to compute for a sec. No problem. It is I'm still gonna... small battlefield. Go. Oh, we good. Wow. Yeah, we're just going to stick with small battlefield today. Oh, All right, good. it's three versus three. Good luck. GG's. Okay, I'm back. It's asthmatic. Where is the content? <laughs> the content right content here, is bro. right here, you're my friend. It's right here. You know what? You're also the content, asthmatic. You're also <laughs> That's true. You are also the content. But here we have some extra content. J uh, oh, no. Yeah, no need to take stocks. Okay. Yep. E-slug. Oh, good air dodge out of that PK fire. Wow, that beats that? That's the first thing I've like ever seen that beats uh, Naruto's Love. Yeah. Yeah, that's really surprising, actually. <laughs> <laughs> like, everything loses to that. Yeah. you uh, and 
Look, there's only two characters I've ever gotten mad at playing against in this game. One of them's Luigi, and the other one's Zelda. <laughs> there's, only, there's only two times that my Switch has ever popped out of the dock from me slamming my fist on <laughs> <in> the table. <laughs> uh, oh, wow. And that's, that's that, that one move alone. Yeah. Oh, my God. Isog's doing a very good job, though, keeping the spacing going. Mm -hmm. Oop, a whiffing on to that back air. With those uh, Din Spires and the Furrows Winds on stage, because he can absorb the Din Spires. True. Oh, I like nice what he's going for. Yeah, like just, the, just the spacing was a little off. Yeah. Oh, with That's the back air. Oh, keeping it low for the step forward air. Very even. Oh, he could have got up for the oh, kill there. Oh, that could have popped him. Nice neutral B. Covering with everything. <laughs> <laughs> Zelda just, in, you know, in it to spin. Yeah, spin it to win it. Spin it to win it. There we go. And it's a spin, spin to win. Spin it to win. <laughs> <laughs> nice soldier to inspire. Oh, air dodge is away. Nice air dodge. There. Oh, but the soldier is going to take it. Very nice coverage. These slugs starting the comeback. 93%. Oh, the reflection! Oh, the lasting the hitbox! Last oh my god. Frame. Dude, I'm oh, sorry, but I hate, so I hate that move. That's gotta be so <laughs> tilting if you're the Ness player. I am very tilted right now. I'm not <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if you can reflect PK Flash, too. Oh, it must. That <laughs> I want to see it. <laughs> Let's make this happen, guys. We can do it. Yeah, this Ness player is definitely having some issues approaching East Slug right yeah. now. He's like doing a great job kind of keeping him at bay. He's... Ooh, and a surprise for Rurus Wind. At, at the end of that... At the end of that first talk, East Slug, East Slug just really decided to slow it down. Mm. And it's kind of forcing James to be in this really slow position as well. And Ness kind of wants to be in your face at all times. And if he can't get in and kind of mash on you, it becomes a lot harder for him. Because yes, Ness taking his time means he's probably in, in getting in a disadvantaged state, mm. you know? So. 134 and now. Oh, good lands the crowd. <laughs> Oh, that kills! Wow. The forward throw from Zelda just kills? That's the crazy. DI. East Slug on the verge of tying things up here with the reverse three stock. 32%, 39 now. Onto this Ness player. The up smash lands too. Ooh. Wow. East Slug. Wasn't, this the, wasn't this the case last time East Slug was on stream? Yeah, he just popped off. He's popping off. Oh, couldn't quite get that drift. The and coverage, man. Spacing off on that. Rose Wind doesn't land either, but uh, I think it's a little bit of matchup unfamiliarity for this Ness player. Doesn't seem to know how to approach East Slug. Just like getting wow. a little fancy there, going in for the grab. Ooh. East Slug really putting on the pressure. It's crazy. Oh, but the sweet spot back air is finally going to take the stock. Oh, I thought that, I thought that was it. Yeah, that was right close. there. That up air. Oh, that was close too. Let's just gotta still gotta close it out here. Nice back air string. Oh, oh. he jumped into the PK he, flash. Hey, I will say that was a tough call because yeah. you you need to stall as long as you can, but you don't want to yeah. go too low. Nice air dodge from James. Jimmy boy. Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy. Yugi boy. <laughs> <All right. laughs> just absorb those Dins fires if uh, he's like just gonna throw them out like that. Ooh. Tricky movement. Mm -hmm. uh, now I think East Slug's getting a little too desperate to take this stock. Yeah. He needs, to, he needs to slow it down. Do what he's doing before. Very nice jump. Jumping over at that time. Very nice evasion. Like, jeez. Mm -hmm. Soldier. That's going to do wow. it. Wow. And we are sitting at three stocks to two. Very winnable here. Four posts. East Slug doing a good job. Almost evening things up. Nice, no, nice, right uh, back. yeah. GG, well played, East Slug. All right, it's their last player, and it's, uh, should be still a small battlefield. And, uh, don't forget to SD once. Of course. Good luck. Thanks, Coach. I don't really need to go back to them because we're not doing stage picks here. <laughs> uh, are we just doing all, all small battlefield? Oh, you got a fan in chat. Frisco. <laughs> yeah, we're just doing small paddle. Oh people. my heck. <laughs> Who Kex. is that? <laughs> Kex. Maybe later. Maybe I'll be around <laughs> for some back for blood later on. Is that good? 
It's like I like fun. it so far. I've, yeah. I've only played like a few hours of it. Um, I was a little afraid that the card system was gonna be too egregious for me, mm. but I actually, I'm actually really enjoying it. Like it, cool. it just feels like it feels like Left 4 Dead, just with like you know buffs in between like rounds that you can stack on. That's cool. It's, I think it's cool. I think it's very good. I'm actually pretty pretty happy with it. Well, thanks to the um, not doing stage bans in VIX, this has been the fastest match we've ever done so far. It's only 8:20, <laughs> and we're almost at the end of game one already. Oh jeez. It's a King K rule. All right. So it's going to be East Slug with two stocks remaining versus the final player from Providence College, a King K rule player, also named James. <laughs> Everyone Jimmy Boy is just been named on James. My mind. Crazy. Yes. <laughs> Dude. I just, you know, they're all about their Jameses out there. <laughs> all about them James. About them James. No Jimmies. <laughs> no Jimmies. <laughs> Johnson, I like Jimmy's. <laughs> oh wow! Ooh. It just clanked. Oh, the spacing. Just for the grab there. Yeah. Great start here from the freshly buffed crocodile. Very true. <sighs> what was that? Did you? Did... <laughs> Excuse me. Did you happen to catch the K roll matches with um, Kirby Kid over the over the weekend? No. Uh, he's he was in uh the uh, Smash World Tour. And he, you know, was playing with Tweak and everybody. He did yeah. very well. He cool. actually took sets off like Naito. It was crazy. Wow. I, I think I think the yeah I think the Croc is actually going to be pretty relevant again, at least at on like a mid tierish level, mm -hmm. which is considering his weight class, that's saying a lot. Yeah, for sure. So. And his size, like he's just massive. Yes, exactly. I think we'll see, I think we're going to be seeing a lot more K rule. I think I think he's just got enough going Ooh, for him where he's smash. he can be in contention. Oh, it was oh. going for it. I respect it. I respect it. Oh, the floor's went using place. The, yeah, using it to fade away. That was yeah, actually really cool. Oh, wow. Still alive, though. One, he's two, a one. big boy. Yeah, he chonky. <laughs> he chonky. He's not going to guys walk in. Oh, but that up smash is going to take it, and we're all even up two stocks apiece now. Very nice up smash. Oh, dash attack, though. Oh. Barely makes Ooh, very nice recovery. Yep, great job using the full... Oh, the full range of Din's uh, Furore's Wind, rather. And then the sweet spot forward air. He's like on a bit of a wind, rampage wind, right now. Spin to win, spin to win, spin to win. Spin to win is absolutely right. Walks into the clap, though. A get up. Oh, sure. That was interesting. And it's pretty close now. 92%. Wow. Another Din's Fire is going to take That's it. it. And he's wow. like one stock away from taking the game for Pose. Now this is something where Slug can just take his time. He doesn't need yep. to approach K Rule at all now. Yeah. Jimmy, uh, James, K Rule, whatever you want to call him, <laughs> having a lot of issues. Jim J Drool! <laughs> getting his uh getting his projectiles out and oh, 95% now. Oh, and he hangs on no. much too long, and there it is! Game one under goes to pose. Oh my god. No. E Slug popping off on this Zelda. Gonna take the dub, and we're heading to game two. Oh geez, and you can just jump right into a small battlefield again, no stage picks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna see if they wanna do that again for game two. <laughs> okay, right go for it. GG, Isla, well played. Thanks coach. Great job. Um, yes. Uh, do you guys want to do the same thing for stages? Do you want to just do like PS2 forever this time, or another we stage? Can it. Yeah, let's. I mean, that's fine with me. I'll ask them if they want to do PS2. You guys still cool with the order? Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah, we'll do uh, Pokemon Stadium two this time. So, okay. uh, Proto, you're up first. Alright. Good luck. Alright, we're back. And, uh, it's, we're gonna be doing PS2 this time. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> back to nine stocks apiece. Ooh, and it's a Sora. We got Ooh. a character swap coming out from Providence here in game two. 
I believe this was the... If they didn't change the order, this was the Incineroar player. Hmm. <clears throat> Interesting. But they might have changed their player's order. So, I think Sora is going to be a very strong character in the future. Oh, yeah, um, for sure. I, I think the spells oh, he has... Oh, now it's very stylish, Kirby. Oh, and he's got all yeah. three spells? That's so good. Yes. Wow. I actually... This, this might do very well for Kirby, honestly. It gives him a nice zoning tool for, yeah. like, approaches and whatnot. Yeah. <laughs> I, he just this probably, his own thunder. I actually think this probably buffs Kirby a significant amount, not gonna lie. Oh, Proto. Oh, Proto! Oh, no, don't God. like that! Oh, man! Proto! <laughs> He freezes wow. him and blasts him with his own spell twice, and then just the fully charged F smash right to the noggin. Hit him the Faraga. Do, do it again. Do it again. <laughs> oh, he went for it. Oh. He was too close, though. Nice dash Proto attacks. Ooh, doing the fair strike right oh. now. Yep. Oh, again with the F smash. So, yes. Sour spot at that time, though. Oh, oh, oh! He, oh, I think I think Sora can come back from that. Oh, yep. he can. He's like one of the yes. only characters that can. I was I was yeah. I was like, oh man, maybe. Yeah, Sora just has that good of recovery in this oh, game. Oh yeah, he's sure. crazy. Probably the best recovery in the game. Yeah, not, I'm probably not even kidding. aside from Jigglypuff. Uh, yeah, true, true. Wow, that was a lot of damage. Already 101. Oh, he lost the projectiles. Oh, but the thunder. There's that stock. Takes it. Or even up Get now, again. but a 100% lead for Proto. It's like one of those instances where I think Kirby really needs to get that those spells. Mm, yeah. Oh, whiffing the dash attack. But again. But again, oh, down smash though. Nice, nice awareness. Ooh, that was interesting. That was a weird interaction. I don't even know what to, what to say about that. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's gotten to, it's gotten to the point where the pressure is just kind of laying on, and Kirby doesn't really have anything to kind of cover the bases now that he lost the spells. Mm. Um, so I, th I do think the spells in this matchup are kind of do seem kind of important in order to have like an even ground with Sora. Otherwise, Sora's oh, gonna oh the just hammer, yeah, dropping down. Very nice hammer. Ooh, good good air dodge, getting rid of that up smash. Ooh, not opting for the up there. And James is really starting to feel comfortable, just kind of, you know, throwing these hitboxes out that are really active to kind of keep Kirby at bay. Mm -hmm. And it's, you know, with Kirby's speed, it's kind of difficult. Oh, he's got it back now. Good, he's got the good. spells back. Yeah, I do. Th <laughs> I really do think that this is the key to victory. Oh my, you did it. <laughs> yes, I did. I, I both put it all out, but legitimately, I do think the spells are going to be very important to keep Sora out. Yeah, yeah. That's so... <laughs> Yeah, you really, you really dad with me right there. I need it. Mm. They give me life. <laughs> Spacing out that back air, keeping it away. When we were hanging out with Liz, was like, oh yeah, Armin's gonna be the daddiest dad. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Maybe. Like, yeah, you're right. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, probably. Very close, final <laughs> stock though. Ooh, Thundaga lands. Is Proto gonna do it to him again? Oh, not quite. Oh, he's going for the Thunder. Oh, he oh. drops it. Yeah. Very nice. Oh, Thunder the wrong way, still escapes the punish. They're just now, firing thunder. their own spells back at each other <laughs> repeatedly. I do can't it again. handle this. They're on the same now, spell not... rotation. Oh, that hammer doesn't land though. Oh, oh, the F-Smash does take it. Yeah. That'll do it. And it'll be 7-6 to six again after game one. And it'll be Those spell Eevee up next. Yeah. Those spells are very interesting because they, they act in different ways depending on how you use them. Like the, the Thunder, if you're in the air when you use it, it right. the range of it is a lot closer to Sora. Right. And it can't go through platforms, whereas you use it on the ground, it goes through platforms and it's farther away. Oh, I away. didn't know about the platform. Uh, yeah, it's, it's very, it is very interesting. I actually played a lot of Smash today because we had an open house for the uh, students starting in January. And so we brought oh, yeah? the Switch over to, uh, you know, the building where all the tables were set up with the different clubs. And when they got to our table, we just had Smash go. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. That's so cool. And you get new people playing in on rotation and whatnot. 
Yeah, yeah. I mean, there weren't too many people because it was kind of like middle of the year, so there's not too many new students. But um, there was a decent amount of people. I don't think we ever got to where there was a line of people waiting, which is also kind of nice, too, because um, yeah. you don't want to just be like sitting around. You know, when we were in college, Brawl had come out, mm -hmm. and, which it shows our age. Oh, yeah. And um, sure. and uh, <laughs> I remember one of, the, one of the hypest things, I still remember they had like a bunch of tournaments when Brawl first came out, and it, the rooms were packed for oh, all that. Yeah. I, remember, yeah. I remember people were so hyped just to yeah. watch Luigi recover from the bottom blast zone. Like, <laughs> yeah. was, like Brawl back in the day was just so hyped, bro. It was so cool <laughs> watching it. Yeah, and then people realized now, it was just like a really crappy version of Melee. It was actually the sucks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude, all the trip. I had never really night. played was... melee competitively though, so I didn't even know. Yeah, neither did I. Like it was one of the things I just played all the time at my friends' houses, mm -hmm. and you know, I was like, "Why can't I beat it? Why can't I beat him with Mario?" <laughs> but... I just like playing like the uh, the single player modes. Like the, uh... I miss I miss subspace. That that was so cool. Mm, yeah, subspace was cool. I think probably better than World of Light, all things considered. Yeah, it was. But World of Light is actually pretty good, considering yeah. what it is. Yeah, it's, it's just bad. a... The mode is just a, like a love letter to like everything that's mm. games. So it's just like... I don't know. I I enjoyed it when I played it. It was a lot longer than I thought it was going to be. Yeah. Granted, that, they can do that when everything's just a JPEG. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> but, oh, that's going to take the stock, though. James going all the way up there to get Eevee. Yeah, and, those, uh, those auto combos. 44%. Oh, there's a nice up throw. Almost grabs the oh. up air combo. Not quite. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, you can jab lock with that oh, thing? Oh, no. Wow. Jab lock, that... She panicked and uh, buffered yeah. the air dodge. I didn't know you had. I didn't know it was quick enough that you could jab lock with it. I don't. I didn't think you could either. Maybe they, they, have, they probably have to be at a very specific range. Probably. And then, like, it won't oh. work after, like, probably two or three of them. Not quite getting enough air on the, for the up air. Mm -hmm. It's going for it, though. It's the right idea. Yeah. I'd like to see, like, a bit more back air usage in this map up, matchup to try and, and try and keep Sora at bay. with Because, yeah. you know, that's a huge disjoint. Debatably bigger than Sora's Keyblade. So it'd be nice to see, you know, that move to get kind of keep him out. Yeah. Lap bomb's gonna land though. Under 11% now on Sora, but on the verge of a three stock here. As Eevee just scoots in between those Thundaga charges. Good scoot. Right now, Sora's in disadvantage though. Oh, got stage control. Nice fair on the sour spot. Eevee just gotta take her time. Very nice splat bomb. Oh, a little too low. I think that was a side B that came out instead of the up B. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, I do that. I do that all the time with Wonderwing. Post down to three stocks though. And now comes the Zelda. E Slug coming in with the nice spins. E Slug gonna have to. Uh... Gonna have to save the day here and take seven stocks with only three of his own. We'll see if he can do it. I mean, he's done some crazy stuff in the past, so we'll see. He did go on quite a tear in game one, so. Still gotta get through this Sora, though. <clears throat> and then the next We're gonna be taking first two. player. Now, these are all matchups I feel like are very doable for Zelda. Um, mm -hmm. Granted, I don't know about, you know, Sora, because he's very new. Yeah. But, you know, only one stock. Yeah, just the one stock. I feel like it's very doable for East Slug. Um, Naruto's love is going to be really important in this matchup, because he's going to be able to get rid of his... He's going to be able to stuff his approaches like that and also reflect the magic. Yes. The only thing I can foresee he being needing to be careful about is Sora's counter. Because mm, I don't know. I haven't seen him use it this whole match yet, though. I don't know if. Have you seen the clip of Banjo? Of Banjo he, he, using Wonder Wing against it? No. Banjo dies at 40. 
What? If you if center stage, I'm not even kidding. Center stage what? 40. If it will stop Wonderwing and it will hit Banjo and he dies at 40. Oh my goodness. Center stage. It's so dumb. Wow. I his counter is so dumb. I love it. But beyond that, you know, right now Isla is wow. win. Isla loves going for that. And uh, that takes care of the sword player from Providence. We still got two more option. players to get through. Let's see if they decide to go for any sort of switch, because I can imagine for them the K rule matchup is going to be pretty rough. Though then again, they could probably be banking on the sheer fact that it's you know six stocks need to be taken. Yeah. The viewers for the stream keep spiking and then going right back down. Like, they'll spike up to, like, 12, and then it'll go back down to 5. And then I'll look again, and it'll be back up to 12. Look what's happening right now. <laughs> Those people that are leaving just don't know what they're missing, bro. <laughs> Dunktastic. Ready? And it is going to be the Ness player sticking with the Ness. Did have a lot of problems against Eastlug in Game 1. We'll see if his uh, problems continue. But Eastlug basically needs to... Uh, Get a three stock or at least a two stock here and give himself a good chance against the K rule player from Providence. Yeah. Eastlug really needs to come with these matches at a very slow pace. Keep Ness at a really, you know, d big distance. Not a whole lot he can do. Ness at a slow pace is not where he wants to be. He wants wow, to be up in I your face doing whatever. <laughs> yeah. Wow, the spacing. Sure. Eastlug doing a great job so far early. Oh, wow, interrupts the uh, side smash. Dash attacks on James. Oh, reflected. <laughs> oh, I love it. Wow, that soldier's attack range is so big. I know. You would you never expect it. This is one of those things where it's like you really kind of need to be like above soldier. You can't even count on being like just right outside the range or yeah. like right above it. You need to be like out. <laughs> yeah. It's guarding opportunity for Ness. Can't quite find anything. Soldier punch. <laughs> Soldier punch. <laughs> He's like just dro dropping these hitboxes out. He, yeah, he absorbs Ooh. the inspire. Good adjustment. Oh, I thought he had him right there. Wow. Ooh, up air takes it. What a string. <laughs> wow. On the last frame again. It's so funny. Ness dash attack. Oh, catching with the up air. Ness making a lot of good adjustments here in he uh, game two. Much more confident approaching, I've noticed. Yeah, he's right within that range on Zelda that Zelda feels very uncomfortable. She Ooh, doesn't like it when you're on top of her. Yeah, but she also doesn't like it when you're in that mid range. And, mm. and he's doing a very good job kind of staying in there and keeping that burst range pressure on. Yeah, now he's calling out the Dense Fire. Mm -hmm. Oh, trying to go for the anti-air, but not quite catching it. Very nice. Kind of choking out these approaches with shield and dash attack and whatnot. Oh, back here is going to connect, though. Fair missing. He's like taking his time, going low with the recovery. Oh, not quite covering with Phantom. Little shy on the on the actual reach. Dins fire, absorbing it. Has that to start all over 26%. again. Twenty-six percent. Yeah, that absorb that absorption is crazy. He still can't be on autopilot, just throwing out those dense fires. Like you have to. He's calling it out now. Like you said, he's got to go. Yeah. Right now. Oh, nice. He still like needs things. to. Yeah, the Phantom needs to be in range with Dins fire as well to kind of ca get that trap going. Yeah. Oh, very nice up smash. Wow. Ooh, wow, great DI from uh, James there. Wow. Saving, likely saving the stock. Oh, but the Dins Fire was not expecting it that All time. Right. East Slug needs to take now. this final stock, though. He does not want to go into this last game with just the one stock remaining. They're off to a great start. 30% already. Oh, wow, that Ooh, went through wow. Love. Crazy. I'm so surprised. 
Ooh. Isla gets away with a lot of bad habits because he just smashes B <laughs> right, after, <laughs> right after he does something that's not ideal. <laughs> hey. Hey, if he gets away with it, he gets away with it. We aren't gonna, we aren't gonna, we aren't gonna complain. <laughs> that was a nice dash back. Hey, come on! Oh, what what? The, oh, no way! Wow, wow, that killed. Unreal. And we're in the Two, exact same three. place we were in game one. Eastlug doing some hard carrying here on the Zelda. Two weeks in a row, man. Really showing up. GG, well played, Eastlug. Yeah. All right, same spot as we were in game one. <laughs> you got this. I've been here before. I think it's going to be the K rule here. Yeah. And let's see if he swaps characters. But anyways, good luck, and don't forget to SD once. See you all on the you other side. Good. All right, we're back. It's going to be Eastlug with two stocks versus the Providence College player who oh, I believe... Oh, 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 oh. I believe we're on the K Rule player. Let's see if he swaps characters or sticks with K Rule. Fantastic. More than it is going to be the K Rule yet again. So the K, K Rule Zelda matchup. He slugged with now two stocks is, remaining. Now, this is going to be generally the same thing where it's a matter of, you know, E Slug yeah, needs to. Take, needs to take his time, keep K Rule out. Though K Rule, I would say, debatably has a few more tools to deal with Zelda, when it, especially when it comes to Crown, which is. You know, can go through almost any other projectile in this game. Um, that Nars fast love, air. <laughs> and there, there was love. There we go. True. Very true. She Very can true. Any, she can answer almost anything that K. Rool wants to do in the mid range with Naru's love. Very true. Always great about Naru's love. Use of the soldiers so far to start things off, though. Oh wow! Even though after that combo from. Uh, K. Rool oh, player. very nice spacing. Nice, great punish there, going with the F smash. Wow, just barely Very good him. awareness. Oh, that F smash oh, is so wow. good because it brings her hitbox back. And the Dense Fire takes it, and yeah. just like that, we're all even at two stocks East look, East look is a monster. He is a monster I am convinced. right now. That dash back forward smash doing so much work for him in this matchup. Yeah. And the dash back dash attack, too. I... The, the awareness on the hitboxes on Phantom and how long you need to charge it is so impressive. It catches me off guard. There's five different charges. Do you know that? There's five different levels of Phantom. Yeah. I, I don't know how any of them work. <laughs> yeah, the longer you charge it, it affects, like... But it's so, like, small a window. Like, to get the char to get the window where he slashes, like, across his body instead of doing the, like, vertical slash. Oh. Down to That's gonna not, take it. Yeah. Not quite good enough of a mash there. But yeah, it's only a couple frames. Very nice control. Midway charge. Oh! Wow! Beautiful! Beautiful! And we're even. dead even now. One stock apiece. It's all going to come down to this final stock. Did you see that? How she low profiled his clap because she was, was in his belly? That was nuts. <laughs> and then he just goes for the Aurora's wind kill. No fear. Wow. Oh! He almost dodged what? right into that soldier. Oh, oh the armor going right armor, through us. Oh, didn't quite get enough range on that for us. Yeah. <gasps> no, the armor on there. the belly. <laughs> he, oh, wow. Oh, he nice totally soldier thought protecting he had the punish. recovery. Yep. Wow, it's Ooh. still dead even. 80%. <gasps> oh, he no! reflected it. No. <laughs> wow. Oh, my God. Oh. oh, no way. He reflects it. And we're going to game, game three. three. Wow. I did not even know that he could reflect. That's Very crazy. nice stuff to Providence College on that. Oh yeah! Wow, what an ending! Oof! I forgot he. I forgot that was in his toolkit. Yeah, yeah, he's got a counter. Oh my! I God. didn't know they would actually send the Phantom back at you though. That's crazy. I didn't even know that the interaction existed. I want them all. <laughs> Great job first. though. You almost finished him off again. No, because I can't handle the K roll if I get to it. Come so. at me, I come at me. Dang. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so you're up then again, Proto. Right. We're sticking with Let's the Let's see. Uh, what, do, what do you guys want to do this time? You guys want to do. Uh, want to yeah. do. I don't know, Final Destination. We got to go Final Destination, right? It's the final game. 
the final. Yeah. Ryan low, Ryan low, kill him, kill him, kill him. Yeah, FD. FD? FD? I'm asking mm. him. No, we want platforms. All right, we'll do FD this time. Mm. <laughs> All right. All right, good luck, Proto. Good luck, Proto! All right, I'm back. This match, we're going FD all the way. Ooh. Very nice. Final destination for the final match. So well, I'm in training mode. I'm trying to practice my footstools out of shield, and it's very hard on Sheik. Uh, yeah, I can imagine. Her hit hitbox is so thin. That was, that was like Ike's whole game plan in Smash 4 was these weird footstool combos. I was not for it. I was not about it. <laughs> no, I, I have no clue. I had no clue about any of that stuff. Yeah. But like the only thing Banjo has out of with footstool out of shield is his dare. And even then that doesn't really combo into anything. It's more of like mm. he gets the he gets the dare and it's like, what do you do after that? You have to like make a yeah. read. <laughs> but uh, it's going to be Mario player here for Providence College. I think probably. probably the original Incineroar player. Yes. Slash Sora player. Good old Mario versus Kirby matchup. <laughs> Sakurai's baby versus Masahiro's baby. <laughs> uh, so Masahiro. Uh, oh my god. Tor no, well, Sakurai's baby <laughs> versus... Uh, why am I forgetting his name? Uh, Iwata? No, name? not Iwata. The guy. Oh my God! The president. <laughs> he was president of Nintendo for the. Uh, Bowser? No. Uh, J right. for Japan. Mike. Oh, <laughs> this is gonna drive me nuts. I'm sorry. That I'm taking up time on this, but <laughs> oh Google my God. It. Go Google. <laughs> oh my God. He was like on the last Nintendo Direct, so like, talk about the the Mario movie. Uh, I know exactly. You don't see him that about, often. I can't think of his name either. Oh my God. Uh. That is like the third or fourth time that Proto has gone for a dash attack, and the Mario player is just punished with the uh, forward smash. <laughs> I'll forget it. I gotta focus. I gotta focus on the match. I'm sorry. I'll think of it later, and then I'll remember. Uh, this Mario 84 to 120. Loves throwing out those F smashes. Back oh, air back air not quite doing stock. it. Ooh, oh, too low going for that down B there, Proto. Oh, dare on shield, not quite safe. Nice dash attack, though. Throwing James right back off stage. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, the, the read was there, but. Oh. Yet again, another dash attack dash gets back. punished. Oh, back here, throwing him right off stage again. Oh, oh going a little too, yep. Yeah. Mm. We take those. Oh, another dash really? Attack gets punished by yeah. the forward smash. Fourth yeah, time really now. waiting out these dash attacks. <laughs> yeah, Pro should get. Pro needs to get at least one more stock to yeah. kind of keep this, keep the flow going. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Going for another read with the smash attacks. Dash attack, up throw. <laughs> They're up there. You oh. just tossing them up there. <laughs> Throw the screen ball up. Yeah, the dash attack and the F smashes. Just getting a little too predictable with that. Back throw? Yep, back throw from Mario. Throws Kirby right back off stage. It just feels like Proto doesn't really have a game plan. He's just running at him and throwing out dash attacks. Yeah, it's it's one of those things where um, replace the dash attack with run up shield a lot more. Mm. And, you know, you'll get, you'll get those approaches a lot better. Option. Yeah. Correct. Exactly. See, he's, he's fishing. You don't have to throw out a hitbox. Correct. That's Good dash attack there, though. Him, though. Yeah. But the next time he does it, he's going to be ready. Yeah. Oh, this might take back it. Throws in, yeah, back throw's going to take it. Yep. And there it is. So, Providence College down to eight. And post down to six stocks here. Off to a better start. Is Providence in game three? Ryan's not there. Give me a moto. 
Miyamoto, yeah. Miyamoto, right. not not Masahiro. I'm <laughs> I'm thinking that's of Sakurai's Masahiro name. Sakurai. Yes, yeah, yeah. I was like, why can't I think of Miyamoto? <laughs> it's like I know it. It's like, oh my god. GG Proto. All right, Evie, you're up. Good luck. Make sure Finally, you change it. Finally, you figured to... out it was Miyamoto. You're driving <laughs> me crazy. <laughs> uh, oh, Streaming. You're Miyamoto! watching the stream. It's Miyamoto. Were you watching the stream while you were playing? Don't do that. I could, I could hear Eastlug watching it. They're pushing up towards me. I need help up here. Uh, Evie, you there? They said we can choose the next stage if you want. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. My Discord, like, crashed. I have no idea what happened. I am so sorry. That's okay. Um, they said we can yeah. pick the next stage if you want, or we can just go back to FD. Your choice. Um, can I pick Kalos? Asking. Mm -hmm. When you change it to Kalos, they'll probably say yes. Okay. I just don't want to intrude on their like anything. Oh no, you're like, fine. All right, they said I don't wanna... they said we're good to go for Kalos. Oh, awesome. Should be up against the Mario with say. two stocks. Yeah, we did. Okay. Good Wait, luck. I have two stocks, or the Mario has. Two Mario stocks? has two stocks. Help, help. Oh, all right. That's that's good. I can work with that. Good luck. I need help. I have a Reinhardt on me on point. All right, we're back. Welcome it's back. Be Evie. Most likely an inkling. We're going to Kalos. I'm gonna make sure that she switches to Kalos. Just don't forget to actually change it to Kalos, Evie. Oh yeah, thank you. I probably needed that reminder because I probably would have. <laughs> okay, I am going to go do that right now. Also, shout outs to Chris Rammers <laughs> and all the teams he's on. I don't know if he heard that, but I hope he did. <laughs> oh, he so. did. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Shout outs. Okay. Uh, oh god, I gotta find my control. Oh, never mind. Found it. <laughs> okay. Right. Good luck. Kalos. Yep. Thank. All right, we're back for good this time. It's gonna be in inkling. Evie's inkling on Kalos versus uh, Mario. Mario player from Providence College with two stocks remaining. Yeah. This <clears throat> Inkling versus Mario, this is definitely going to be one of those matchups where back air is going to be a very important tool against Mario. Uh, Mario just doesn't have, like, um, well, Mario can very w well deal with certain disjoints. It's, you know, but it's always still going to be something he has to think about just because uh, he, he doesn't really have any disjoints himself besides, like, Cape um, and Fireball to kind of cover these approaches. Um, but, you know, Mario's a very, you know, movement-heavy character. He's very versatile. He can kind of get around these options. Mm -hmm. But utilizing any disjoint that you have against Mario is very important. Otherwise, he's going to be juggling you for days. And there he goes. Doing the shimmy. <laughs> the shimmy's the best. <laughs> Just as you say it, you've already thrown out those uh, those aerial options. Indeed. Wow. Jumping off his head. Massive footstool. <laughs> <laughs> I always love the accidental footstools. Yeah. They're like the they're like some of the best parts. Wow. The jab oh. Block. Jab block very strong. Very nice back airs. Mario doing the back throws. Oh, oh nice splat bomb. Yeah, splat bomb hits. Can't quite get the roller, though. 
Oh, out. the down air. air gone. Oh, I didn't continue that. Another nice back air lands though. But Eevee at 131. Quality stock, but needs to take some more. Let's do some more damage here. That might do it. Yeah, I don't think yeah. he had a jump there. <clears throat> yeah, that's that's tough. Oh. Double rolled. It's a very very nice. Mario. <laughs> nice get up attack. Block that time. Ooh, spacing with the forward smash. And fair. And then oh, another fair another for the one. spike. Great job by uh, Mario from Providence College here. He really needs to at least take this one stock here. Indeed. It'll put us in the exact same place as we were in games two. <laughs> one and two. If he takes this one stock here. Hey, I think they're up for the challenge. I think he slugs up for the challenge for sure. <laughs> Nice dash attack. He needs to find that KO though. As traditionally, as uh, traditionally, I should say, um, in the past, she has generally struggled to actually find the killing blow. Great at racking up percent. But yeah, he needs to that's, find that's, that powerful attack. It's gonna be either be like a landed fair or something like that. Um, sometimes back air off stage. Oh wow. Went Very really deep, went deep for it. attempt there. That was a good edge guard attempt. Couldn't quite find it though. You might also be able to sneak in like a roller, like right mm -hmm. here, but I think it's oh. tough. Yeah. Nope. Forward smash mm -hmm. is gonna take it. And, and that's another thing. Eight is that three? Yeah. Another thing is though. Ink I guess ink you know, right now in the meta, a lot of people are questioning um, Inkling's general kill potential. Because I guess, you know, Inkling can have a tough time killing in certain situations when it comes to, like, approaches and whatnot. Yeah. Um, but, you know, these are all things that, you know, need to be cognizant of. Yep. And then finally comes the E-Slug. Now, Zelda versus Mario. That should be a good one. It's probably even, just because of Mario's approaching tools. Um, yeah, let me just... Hold on, I just have to go with the stage selection. GG's, well played. Um, Isla, you can Thanks, pick the I stage tried. if you By like. By the way, I can't hear anybody. If anybody's, I mean, I can hear Coach, but that's it. We weren't, we weren't really talking. Oh, okay. okay yeah, so Which stage would you like, Isla? Uh, we're good with Kalos. You're good with good Kalos? With okay. Yep. Alright, don't forget to let him SD once. Good luck. Thanks, coach. Alright, we're back, and uh, it's going to be E Slug. With an uphill battle here, going to have to take all almost the entire nine stocks of Providence College here. Bye bye. <laughs> I think this matchup probably favors uh, Zelda, if I had to guess. I don't play any either of these characters often, obviously. Yeah, but... it's gonna it's gonna be one of those things where it's like, well, how well can the Mario approach? That was he that did was the upbeat on the Phantom. Yeah. yeah, very strange. Very deep recovery. Yeah. Wow. Cool. Mario player just turning it up right now for Providence College. Yeah. All very nice phantoms. So he's got to sit in this range right here and just like spam those phantoms out. He's the uh, Naira's love if he gets in close. Oh, very nice up smash. Yeah, he's very good at reading those landings. Last bit of the hitbox hit him. Nice job for reflecting the uh, fireball. 
and then stuffing the uh, reproach again. Wow. And finally, finally, the Eagles take a stock. Eastlug needs to hold on to this stock. Yeah, he does. He's got two more players to get through after this. Which, considering Eastlug's record today, that's very doable. Yeah, honestly. Oh, just I like. Yeah, well, I like the idea. I like the idea, but it was just the spacing wasn't right there. Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> Again, that punishing smash. the dash attack. <laughs> yes, yes, you're correct. You are correct in this instance. Jeez. Oh, an SD though. Oh! And Isla catches a bit of a break there, but still posts down to two stocks. Hey. That's just enough for e Slug. <laughs> He's got him right where he wants him. <laughs> <laughs> He's like Rocky. Is this Rocky like all beat up in the corner? Yeah. I'll yeah. take all of you out. <laughs> hey, I'll take out all five of you. There's only two of us. <laughs> GG. Well played, e Slug. Ah. I asked them if they wanted to change the stage. Oh, I didn't. I was just changing my Zelda. Oh, okay. Let's see what they I'm say. I'm stress sorting out my. Uh, okay, they're Pokemon good with Kellis. Yep, looks like they're good with Kellis. Good luck. Don't forget to SD once. Yep. Alright, we're back. It's gonna be East Luck. He just wanted to change the color of his Zelda. Ah. Uh. <laughs> But we're still on Kalos here. Uh, East Lug with the final two stocks uh, from of post remaining. Going to be against bye the best player this time. Who had a much better time against uh, East Lug in game yeah. two as opposed to game one. Definitely yeah, made some Ness great play adjustments. This player's been learning. See, that was a gift from East Lug. I have to start. Just a little <laughs> present for you. Oh, fair. Oh, down air. That's a good job using the up the, uh, as a combo breaker there. That was interesting. Yeah. It was very nice. Oh, nice air dodge, honestly. Get up attack against the PK fire. Ooh, it's crazy again, how that ooh. protects her from attacks Everything. down on her, too. Yeah. Not only from the left and right. Oh. He can try to sneak in the Din's fires, like if uh, Ness doesn't have enough time to go for a uh, Psy Shield. Yeah. That's kind of risky because it heals him for about twenty percent. Yeah, and then, like, and then at, after it. after a certain point, it's just like, do I really feel like starting over again? <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Setting up Phantom. Really taking their time. Mm -hmm. Both players kind of making adjustments here. Another reflect. Yes. He's got to go aggressive after he reflects that PK fire, though. He just he's done that a couple times. He reflected the PK fire, and then he's just kind of keep... walked away. Yeah. Ooh, almost catches him. Oh. I I really like the use of like the up hit versus the low hit. I I keep for, I never expect it. Yeah. Wow. wow. He's gonna find the stock though, and he's like trudging away here, doing some work. The the roll got caught. By dash attack. Low recovery again. Oh, Early and then up air. Oh. oh, nice spacing with that back air, snuffing out uh, Ness's oh. approach. Dash attacks for days. Is it an upswing? Yeah, an upswing. Oh, that's going to take a oh, nice yeah. back air and post down to their final stock. Oh, very oh, interesting. <laughs> I love it. Okay, I love okay. it. Okay, you slug, we see you. That's actually a really good bluff. I'm mean, not a bluff, but like a call. It's like yeah. you really want to you want to cross the line. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, nice! Wow, great, job. What? great job using the phantom to bait the uh, approach landing, and then no, taking it with good. the F smash. Eighteen percent. This is gonna try to make it a game. <laughs> he directed the dead spiral away that time. He knew he was ready yeah. to absorb it. Oh, I really like that follow-up. Ooh, up here. Oh. First up here, he's and... landing all series. Ooh, wow, and Dead wow. Spire sneaks through. Does absorb yeah. that one, though. Oh. 
Very oh, nice. Almost catches him there. Oh, the bluff again. Very nice grab. Great grab. He was ready for the Dinspire that time again. It's it's gone to a certain point. Oh, though. he was too late! He was too late that time, and Eastlake yeah. takes it. Providence College down to their final three stocks now. And it's going to be another last game situation. Game three. It doesn't get much better than this. Yeah. Now, those Din Fires off stage at first, I was like, well, he probably shouldn't be using Din's fire on him. He can, he'll he kind of easily absorb him. But after a certain point, after a certain mm -hmm. percent, it's one of those things where it's like, just do it. It's like, he's already at kill percent. He's going to be at kill percent. Just keep throwing it. If he messes up, mm. he will get thrown off. Yeah. And it was very, I feel like that's a very smart kind of call on Eastlug's, you know, on Eastlug's end. To just yeah. keep throwing it out despite, you know, the absorption. Very true. All right. I'm going to get with him for the stage real quick. GG. Well played, Eastlug. Um... Kalos is good for them still. And, cool, that worked uh, for me. It'll be the uh, K role player, I think, this time. So watch out for the yeah. counter here. <laughs> <clears throat> yep. All right, and I don't like get to SD role. twice. And good luck. It's my favorite. I'll see you on the other Oops. side. All right, we're back. And it is going to still be the K role player here for Providence College. He's like, told him to watch out for the uh, reflector this time, the belly reflector on the <laughs> Yes, especially at high percents. At low percents, it's probably okay. But he like has to get though. the three stock here for Post to take the W. Yes. So keep that croc out. Oh, I thought he was... Uh, <laughs> yeah, was James, like, what? James, <laughs> James. Where are you going, James? <laughs> All right. Final stock here. Let's see if he's looking. Turn oh, it around wow. for the Eagles. Look at these claps. These claps. Very nice up B, catching the landing. Oh, powering through the armor. Mm -hmm. Providence College, a rule player, not pulling any punches to start things off. Ooh, the late hit of up to down smash. Once the Phantom start landing, though, I feel like he's like gets in a rhythm. And he's just like ready to go with his next, next option. Oh, what? the armor! Wow! The... What? <laughs> what was that? But the bigger picture here, though. Oh, another nice counter yeah, from James. The, but the bigger picture here is uh, Eastlake is at 126 percent already. Yeah. He's gonna have to play these next few moments perfectly. Indeed. Wow, and that F smash doesn't even take the stock. Oh, oh the weak hit. Yeah, and it was the weak hit from the Inspire. Oh, uh, that might but... do it. Wow, he's still alive. Yeah. Oh, but he hops yeah. in the ball, and that's going to do it. <laughs> yeah. GG, Good stuff to well Providence played. College. Yeah, Providence College is going to take it in the end, the reverse sweep. Congratulations to them. But uh, that's going to do it for tonight for the match. That was a really fun one, though. Thank you for casting with me, Frisco, as always. Always a pleasure. Love it. Thank you for having me. For sure. Um... We will have a match on stream for you next week from Purple Team. So that's uh, Ghost, Great, and Asthmatic. So they'll be back in action for you guys next week. Next Monday at 8. Will you be available uh, next Monday at 8 for us? Of course. I'll be I'll be here. Excellent. I'll, uh, I'll look forward to that. And as far as next, uh, the rest of this week, we've got Valorant tomorrow at 8. Overwatch on Wednesday at 8. And then uh, Rocket League on Thursday at 8. So make sure you tune in for that. Um, and then until tomorrow night, we'll catch you all later. Hope you have a great night. Thanks again, Frisco. No, thank you. Bye, everyone.